na tunajua ni nani anafanya mambo ya counterfeit kweli si kweli small traders SMEs continue to face difficulties in accessing capital that is needed for the expansion of their businesses these coupled with infiltration of counterfeits into the market creating an even business platform for the SMEs <laughs> However, with the creation of the inland transit also known as Boma Line has been set up as part of the government's efforts to facilitate and enhance ease of doing business. The facility is also expected to reduce the cost of doing business for small traders at the Nairobi business district. According to the National Treasury and Planning Cabinet Secretary Okuri Yatani, the depot will save on transportation costs previously incurred when collecting goods from Embakasi inland container depot. The launch of this container freight station will undoubtedly reduce the cost of doing businesses for traders by enabling them to now pick their goods from comfort of their homes in Nairobi as opposed to having to travel to the port city of Mombasa. Tena ambaye ni consolidated itakuwa inakuja mpaka hapa KRA wanafu inaletwa hapa na Kenya Railways KRA wanaifungua hiyo container hapa mizigo inatolewa inawekwa kwa shed kila mtu na mizigo yake we ukuje ulipe kodi yako uchukue mizigo yako uendelee na biashara yako speaking during the event held at the Kenya Railways Corporation headquarters president Uhuru Kenyatta says that the launch of the facility was a beginning of a long journey towards ensuring that all traders have an equal opportunity to run their businesses in the country hiyo mambo mlikuwa mnalipishwa sijui dola 1000 1000 moja sijui container deposit hiyo sasa hakuna tena watu wa KEB sijui kama wako hapa ama wamejificha wewe tumesema namna hii from next week vile una charge container wale kule una charge kule nje una charge what percentage 0.6% hiyo ndio utakuwa una charge hawa hapa This came as President Uhuru Kenyatta sent a stern warning to middlemen who have for a long time taken advantage of the SMEs in the transport sector. Hey, IG, mimi nataka uniwekee CCTV hapa ndio niweze kuona vile naona zile zingine kule ofisi yangu. Eh, hey, hey, mimi nitafuatilia jameni. Bro, usifikirie mume toroka, mimi natawankua na cheki. The ongoing integrated mass transport master plan in Nairobi, five commuter train systems out of the intended 11 commuter trains were launched costing the government about 6.6 billion shillings. NMS will construct a traffic management center at City Cabanas that will utilize traffic cameras, sensors, anonymized location data to provide synchronized signals at 100 new junctions. in addition to the existing traffic lights as well as redesigning and signalizing 25 additional intersections when complete the system is expected to ease traffic as snarlaps which saves between 80,000 to 400,000 minutes as well as over 50 million wasted daily on traffic jams transport cabinet secretary james masharia says the launch of the intra city services is a major milestone for the country as it comes 100 years later this also your excellency has waited 100 years to be done Your Excellency under your leadership all these key milestones are being witnessed which indeed are very historic 20 additional stations will be constructed to help revive township economies the new development is expected to attract a substantial proportion of about 1.5 million Kenyans who commute into the Nairobi Central Business District every day The Nairobi Central Station will serve as the nerve center of operations connecting to 10 stations in satellite towns including newly built stations in Donholm and Pipeline. Linda Koskei K24 TV.